Hey everyone, this is Jay Mills from iPhoneBlogger.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 6 Beta 1 using Red Snow 0.9.13 Dev 1. Now before I go any further, this jailbreak is intended for developers only, as is the iOS 6 Beta 1 firmware. Uh, the jailbreak won't actually install Cydia, there's no graphical interface because the Cydia SDK hasn't been updated for iOS 6 yet. So the only way to install tweaks is through SSH or through uh, USB Explorer or something like that. And also the jailbreak uses the LimeRain boot ROM exploit, so it's a tethered jailbreak that only works on A4 and lower devices. But if you qualify for that, then go ahead and download Red Snow 0.9.13 Dev 1. You can get it from our website, I'll post the link in the description. After you've got Red Snow downloaded, the first thing you need to do the first time you jailbreak iOS 6 is you have to specify your iOS 6 firmware because Red Snow cannot currently download the firmware since it's only available in Apple's developer portal. So just click on Extras, go to Select IPSW, and choose your 6.0 firmware. And then it will say that the 6.0 firmware will be used for the rest of the Red Snow session. Then you can hit back and go to Jailbreak. Now on the Options screen you're going to notice that there's no Install Cydia option, because as I said this will not install Cydia for you. But instead there's this Install SSH option. So this is how you can um, transfer and install applications on your phone once you've got root access. So make sure that option is checked and then hit next. And this jailbreak will only work in DFU mode. You cannot use the backup or store method that you can use for the 5.1.1 uh, jailbreaks. So I'm going to go ahead and put my device in DFU mode. So hold home and power for 10 seconds. And then release power but continue holding the home for another 10 seconds. And then once you've done that, um, you can go ahead and click next and it'll detect your device and begin to exploit with Lime Rain. So I'll just speed up this part and I'll, we'll get back once it's done. Alright, so the jailbreak's done. And as you can see, or as I said before, there's no Cydia installed so there's not going to be any new icons on your springboard or anything like that. And just like it says here on Red Snow, it's a tethered jailbreak. So, in order to get the um, root, to get the root access and the jailbreak functions, we need to go back, and then in the extras options, we need to go to just boot, and that's how you boot tethered. So once again, you got to put the device into DFU mode, and now it's in DFU mode. It's it's going to exploit with Lime Rate again, and then it will boot your device so that you can get uh, root access. And that's it. Once it reboots after you've booted tethered, you're jailbroken. So now you can go ahead and install your uh, applications and tweaks and test them out on iOS 6. Be sure to check out our website, iPhoneBlogger.com, for more tutorials, downloads, live chat, and news for all your jailbreaking and unlocking needs.